Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm Patty. I go by Patty Mac Makes everywhere online. Welcome to my channel and to my creative space. I'm kind of in the process, well I'm not kind of, I'm in the process of rethinking my space and how I'm going to film videos for you and how I'm going to uh, just do the work going ahead <laughs> in the future. I had some really big life changes come um, out of the blue, out of nowhere in the fall and um, it's kind of pushed me forward on some things that I had been considering doing but wasn't going to do it right away. Well, now I'm doing it because just, you know, things happened. Life got busy. Uh, anyway, we're in the new space. And for today's video, uh, this is a special shout out to Vicki of Creative Notions. And I just want to say, Vicki, thank you so much. <laughs> I really appreciate you. And thank you for sticking with me. I have been really late on getting my videos up for the packages that you send me and I don't want you to think that it's not that I don't appreciate you because I really do. Uh, I just um, I haven't been able to do it but here we are today with lovely weather. I have my new um, workspace set up and behind me here you can see the beautiful beautiful box that was sent to me from Vicki of Creative Notions. Um, up to now, I have been get, getting the Creative Notions monthly subscription uh, for, this is the fourth or fifth one, and they have always come in uh, like a soft pack uh, USPS um, bag. And now Vicki has got her own boxes and it's really pretty and we're going to take a look at the box before we dig in to the uh, insides and see what's in there. And um, super fun, I'm going to actually use the setup on the new uh, uh, workspace uh, to film today's video and open the box. So woohoo, here we go. <laughs> As I'm filming this for you today, it's the end of January and you can see, I, I still have my Christmas tree up. <laughs> you know, it is what it is. I think it's pretty, um, the lights are cheerful and helpful for me at, at night, so I, I might leave it up for a while. It may become a Valentine tree before we're done. So let's take a look at the box from Creative Notions, and it is beautiful. Uh, Vicki has put her little trademark uh, vintage camper on, which is adorable. I absolutely love it. This is printed into the box. I mean, this is very nice. Vicki, uh, Vicki at Creative Notions. Uh, does a, a class act on her monthly boxes. So let's see what we've got in here. Ooh, look at that. What I will do is I'm going to move you so that you're close up and you can just kind of see this as I take it out of the box. How about that? But before I do that, can we just remark about how nice the space is? And can you see that? Is that in the shot? I guess it probably is. Oh yeah. Yeah, so that's the ceiling fan poles. They'll have to be um, picked up. But uh, yeah, isn't it beautiful out here? And this piece, you'll have to just uh, stick around if you wanna see this piece, because this I'm really proud of. All right, let's look at the box. Here's the box just as I opened it, and it's wrapped in this beautiful tissue paper. I think he really, Creative Notions is a very nice subscription box. And even though she sends them to me, I would not lie to you. If I didn't like what she was sending, I would not continue to accept it. And her, her things are beautiful. So let's see what we have. So um, she always gives you like a uh, guide to the box. And uh, this month, uh, this is actually um, the December box. And uh, yeah, I'm just opening it now. But you know what? It's okay because it's it's a springtime theme. I do know that. I actually cheated and watched a couple of other channels who get the box. So I knew what was in here. Oh, anyway, uh, basically this is just a little hope that uh, 2021 is a better year. And she's used a little bunny and a little fox, uh, which of course are some of my favorite little motifs. And down here it says, Twinkle, twinkle, little star, do you know how loved you are? Isn't that nice? 
And then inside of the box, what she's going to give you is uh, just kind of a, a rundown on what's going on with the subscription. Uh, this will be what's in here. And uh, she has a Facebook group, which is a nice group of ladies. And she's doing quilt block competitions. So that's kind of exciting. Anyway, she does a lot of stuff. So uh, let's get everything out of the box and then we'll talk about what all of it is. Uh, she also includes a recipe every month and this month it's for banana bread. And you know, you can never go wrong with a banana bread recipe. So this is um, chenille bias tape. So I should say that the um, the subscription set that you get is designed to make a project. So she gives you the fabric to make specific projects. And honestly, it's up to you if you want to make the project or do something else with the fabric. And this is really cute fabric. So hold on. <laughs> uh, okay, this, this is amazing. So she included in here, and I'm really excited about this. This is a maker's planner for 2021. And we'll probably take like a close look at just the book because this looks amazing. And what a great way to organize your projects and, and what you're doing. So what she has here is, it looks like a baby quilt. So uh, they're calling it chenille diamonds. And it, it's all half square triangles. Oh, this is kind of interesting. So it's all half square triangles and uh, four patches. And you know how I feel about a four patch. Except for over here, that's just two. But I, the way I would construct this is four patch, four patch, two up, and then sew the row together. And I would do each row that way. So you get this particular project, and then on the back, She's had a, an annual project going on called the Dottie Sampler Quilt. And last month, I actually did a video where I constructed a tree block. I love this block, by the way. And this doesn't have to be a Christmas block. You could do that all year long. I love trees, and I mean, this does not have to be Christmas. So even though I did it at Christmas, it could be all year. Um, and we're going to go ahead throughout the course of the year and do all of these blocks because they're all... Um, like sampler blocks and the type of blocks that everybody should know how to make. Uh, but for right now, I just have the tree. Okay, so you get uh, the pattern, you get all of this fabric, uh, and the recipe. And let's see what, what we have in here. So the fat quarters are worth $25. And then the planner, that's your big item this month. The planner is worth uh, $34.99, $35 for this thing. And it is a nice looking planner. Uh, and then you have 20 yards, wow. Uh, 20 yards of this chenille, that's worth $12. And then uh, the quilt pattern, $9. And, uh, and then the assembly pattern for the Dotty Sampler quilt, that's worth five bucks. So in total, this is a package worth $85.99, which is a lot of money. And you can get it for uh, $47, as I recall. Uh, check her website for sure. Uh, but let's look at the fabric. I think that's why we're mostly here. So uh, let me move everything else out of the way and I'm gonna change the angle just a little bit. So for this month, the December 2020 uh, sampler box, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different fabrics, which is kind of amazing. And they're all they're, they're really sweet and perfect for spring. So kind of hate to mess up how she packaged this, but um, here we go. Okay, oh, this is so darling. This is all little foxes and bunny rabbits and lambs and ducklings. That is adorable. Oh my goodness. And then this one is a beautiful 
floral print. And here's a darling stripe. It's like a watercolor stripe. So pretty. Oh, this is the, um, this is that twinkle, twinkle little star. Do you know how loved you are? I think that's really nice. One small moment of joy can shine for a lifetime. Oh, that's nice. This is beautiful. The words are so nice. And we all need to remember to use our nice words these days, especially these days. Okay, and this is like little stars. Oh, that's darling. That is a great, I guess you would call it a low volume. And then, oh, I love this. This this is like me all over. I get, I get my love of these florals from my mom. I really do. <laughs> it's so vintage looking. I like this. I would actually uh, consider buying some yardage on that one. I like that a lot. And then we have another watercolor stripe and oh another one of these okay is this the same this is the same okay so you get okay so it looks like you get two fat quarters on the one with the um, the words is that the same let's look and see if that's the same I think it's the same oh okay all right so One is uh, a white background and the other is a blue. So it's the same print, but it's like a different color family. That's very nice. Let's take a quick run through on this Maker's Planner. It is extremely nice. And you know, I, you could go to her website and just buy the planner if you wanted to. So it's got, uh, you know, like just your general information you can put up here. Here's like a little notions pouch. Um, it's got, you know, dates for the year. It's got uh, just some little helpful tips on backing and binding, um, yardage charts, which is nice. So just like little cheat sheets, in other words. It also gives you um, a really nice section on uh, HSTs and how to make those, which is really nice. Uh, color wheels, um, quilting abbreviations and acronyms, which is really nice. Uh, here is like a whole section on color, uh, working with um, like values and tone, or that's your light and your dark. So that's really super cool. Um, swaps, and let's get into the months. So when you get into the months, so you have like a little pocket, and you have what you call a habit tracker, which is not one of my favorite things. Uh, a regular calendar, so you can write that in there. And then uh, this is super nice because now you have a place for uh, projects. So uh, it is for a quilt project. So uh, it gives you a place to put your project name, the pattern, fabric, what fabric you purchased and where. I mean, this is nice. It also lets you track the cost because let's be real, it gets uh, very uh, easy to lose track of what we're spending on projects. And I think it is important to keep an eye on the budget because it can get away from you. Uh, this would be an area where you could put your uh, swatches. And then over here, it's got the project sheet. So it has like, you know, what was hard for you to do? What did you learn? And then you could uh, put actual photos here, which is really nice. So every month it's got several of those. And, uh, oh, I guess, oh, what this is for? This is for cards. I'll have to ask her what that's for. Um, hmm, it's got a couple of those. The recipe cards might fit in there. Uh, and then in February, we get into the blocks. And this is called the card trick block. And um, as I recall, these will be um, blocks for the new year. Let's see what January had. Okay, yeah, the shoe fly block. So these are all like uh, quilting basics and just like really good blocks that we should all have in our back pocket. Let's see what March has. Oh, okay, Irish chain. So there you go. So, yeah, nice. 
every month is just kind of the same. You get a new block that you can try out and um, new block, habit tracker, and projects. And uh, yeah, this is this is a very nice planner. I love the uh, quilt block inspiration that we've got going on here. We could make all of these blocks. These this this basic is your star block, and you would be amazed at how many different things you can make from the same uh, basic layout, which is half square triangles. Some people do these as flying geese. I just do them as the half square triangles. So half square triangles, and uh, in the middle is just a four patch in this case. So super, super fun and easy. This is a nice book. So if you're looking for a way to track what you're doing, uh, the Maker's Planner is super nice and it is included in that December box. So, it's, I mean, you know, you think December box and you, you think Christmas, but <laughs> I think after 2020, we were all just kind of ready to get into spring. Um, anyway, the fabrics in this collection, let me tell you what they are. Okay, so the fabric is by Jane Madey for Wilmington Prints. Jane Madey's charming New Friends nursery collection has sweet baby animals, fresh flowers, twinkling stars, and inspirational thoughts about love in soft colors. The group includes a large panel, a book panel, and repeating stripe and more. So if you go onto the Creative Notions website, you should be able to find the um, the panel prints, and I'll have to look those up myself because those are fun. And you know, I really do like this one. They're all pretty though, but th this one is really speaking to me. And I do like the twinkle stars. That's really cute. Okay, well that is the subscription box for this month from Creative Notions, and I think it's a winner as always. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope that you are inspired to go have a look and uh, perhaps subscribe uh, to the uh, box as well. It's a good one. And as always, I sure appreciate you watching and spending time with me. It means a lot, and I'm so grateful to have you in my life and uh, I hope things are going well for you. And you know what? Stick around. Great things are coming. The, you know, the best is yet to come. And um, that's what I've got for you in this video. I will see you next time. <music>